Psalm 5, verses 1 to 12. Give ear to my words, O Lord. Consider my groaning. Give attention to the sound of my cry, my King and my God. For to you do I pray. O Lord, in the morning you hear my voice. In the morning I prepare a sacrifice for you and watch. For you are not a God who delights in wickedness. Evil may not dwell with you. The boastful shall not stand before your eyes. You hate all evildoers. You destroy those who speak lies. The Lord abhors the, the bloodthirsty and deceitful man. But I, through the abundance of your steadfast love, will enter your house. I will bow down toward your holy temple in the fear of you. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies. Make your way straight before me. For there is no truth in their mouth. Their inmost self is destruction. Their throat is an open grave. They flatter with their tongue. Make them bear their guilt, O God. Let them fall by their own counsels because of the abundance of their transgressions. Cast them out, for they have rebelled against you. But let all who take refuge in you rejoice. Let them ever sing of joy and spread your protection over them, that those who love your name may exult in you. For you bless the righteous, O Lord. You cover him with favor as with a shield. This is the word of God. Praise be to God. Yesterday in Psalm 4, Psalm 4 verse 4, uh, the psalmist suggested that when we lie down in our beds to sleep, that we would ponder our hearts in silence to examine our hearts before we sleep, to confess of our sins, to return to God before we head to bed, to check and examine our souls, what it has been and where it is now before we go to bed. And in Psalm 5, the next psalm, we find a prayer that we must pray, the prayer that, that the psalmist is just suggesting that we pray as we wake up in the morning. We find it in verse 7. But I, through the abundance of your steadfast love, will enter your house. I will bow down toward your temple in fear of you. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies. Make your way straight before me. Brothers and sisters, may this be the prayer that we pray as we wake up in the morning. A prayer that reminds us of where we were before and where we are now. How we were once enemies of God, but now we are welcomed into His house, into His dwelling place. The psalmist proclaims in the verses before, The evil cannot dwell with God. The boastful shall not stand before his eyes. He hates evildoers. He, he destroys those who speak lies. He abhors the bloodthirsty and deceitful men. But through his steadfast love, through his hased, we enter into his house. The psalmist proclaims that, that he is the evil. I am the evil that must not dwell with God. I am the boastful that cannot stand in his eyes. The evildoer that he hates, that's me. The one who speaks lies, that's me. The bloodthirsty, deceitful man, that's me. I am unworthy. I am unrighteous. I am the lawless. But God... Through his steadfast chesed love, he welcomes me. He loves me. He proclaims, God, you are my rock. You are my salvation. You are my righteousness. Brothers and sisters, pray with me. But I, through the abundance of your steadfast love, will enter your house. I will bow down toward your holy temple in fear of you. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies. 
Make your way straight before me, O God. God, lead us, not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let's pray.